Bottom line is, what, what I want to see is I actually say no to a lot of people who say, well, you introduce me to this person, so I'll do it for free, but you have to earn it. And what I mean by earning it is, I need to have a filter to know I'm proud to introduce you because that's my equity. My only equity in, is my reputation. And there's a huge difference between the hyper connector who's just like, meet this person, meet this person, meet this person. Well, everybody knows I'm not filtering, I'm just sandblasting. That's like those recruiters that send you emails. They're like, oh, you wanted a developer, so I found this person called developer, and I just mailed them to you. Like, they didn't put any work into it. If your mentor doesn't have a filter and is just introducing you to everybody, like the best thing a mentor can say to you is, I'd love to introduce you to that person, but you're not ready yet. You need to get there, you need to earn that. Because that means that mentor is not out introducing everybody else to that person too. They actually had to earn it. So I really feel like that's super important in the introduction to kind of the Rolodex, uh, to old school it a little bit. The Rolodex approach is that if someone's just willing to do, do that, even if they're willing to do that for money, the context's not that worthwhile. Because I'll tell you, I know people in my network, I get three emails a day from them, you should meet this person, you should meet that person. That immediately goes to the bottom of my list. There's other people who I know, you know what, this person really values their reputation. They're only gonna introduce me to people that are great. And they, in the introduction are saying, here's why I think you can help them. That meeting I'll take, no money, no time, tell me when I can meet them, I'll do that for you. So I think mentors also, being a super connector isn't a great thing. You wanna be a value connector, not a super connector.